inshallah in this class we are going to solve few questions based on partial differential equations before going to the questions watch here we are having some notations symbols for dou z by dou x we use the symbol p for dou z by dou y we use the symbol q for dou square z by dou x square we use the symbol r and dou square z by dou x dou y generally we use the symbol s and dou square z by dou y square is the symbol we use is t so here you see here what we are going to solve the questions based on elimination of arbitrary constants you see here this a and b this a and b are called arbitrary constants so we have we have to solve this and take out the this arbitrary constants for that watch carefully we have to the partial differentiate this with respect to x and denote this by p suppose this is equation 2 the given equation is 1 and this is equation 2 suppose we again partial differentiate with respect to y suppose this with q now solving this 1 2 and 3 we can take out this ele elementary constants this a and b so after taking out a, a and b we will get an equation in terms of x y z p and q so taking out this elimination co elementary constants we will get the partial differential equations we will get the partial differential equations now if you solve this and we, if we take a constants here what are the element uh, arbitrary constants here a and b a comma b are arbitrary constants arbitrary constants so we have to solve this and take out the elementary constants now so see here how to solve this one see here so let me first differentiate this with respect to x partial differentiation with respect to x that is dou z by dou x partial differentiation with respect to x we don't have x here this is called zero this is constant zero in partial differentiation y is also constant we are differentiating partial with respect to x so dou by dou z of x is one one into a is a therefore a equals to dou z by dou x just now we have seen this symbol is p now again partial differentiation with respect to y we don't have y here 0 this is 0 this is 0 d by dy of y partial different dou by dou y of y is 1 1 into b is b but dou by dou z we represent this with q so q equals to b it's very easy question now let me substitute in place of a as p in, sub, in place of b as q we'll get the partial differential equation so this will be z equals to a into in place sorry in place of a we have to write p p is a px plus b is q q y plus p by q in place of a p in place of b q minus q so this is an easy example let me solve these questions okay now see the next question eliminate h comma k from this equation now let me differentiate partially with respect to x so d by dou by dou x of x square differentiation is 2x so you get like this 2 into x minus h because we are partial differentiating with respect to x we don't have x yet it will be 0 plus but this is a dependent event in the uh, variable we have to differentiate this one z square will be 2, two z d by dz of z square is 2z but whenever we, we are differentiating with partial with respect to x we have to write dou z by dou x we are differentiating z partially with respect to x so this is constant 0 I am doing one thing. Let me do one thing. Take two common. If you take two common, it will go here. Now x minus h in plus z into this is p. Do by do z x is p. So bring this here. Okay, or bring this here. We can write like this. He, sorry, x minus h. You can write like this. X minus h equals to minus z p. Note this. So this is the first equation. This is the second equation. Now similarly partial differentiation with respect to y. We don't have y here, this will be 0. Now y square is 2, y differentiation of y square is 2, y 2 into y minus k plus differentiation of z square is 2z. But we are differentiating partially with respect to z. So this is dou z, sorry, with respect to y, dou z by y, dou y equals to constant is 0. If you take 2 comma, it will get cancelled, bring this here. So what is left here y minus k equals to plus term on the other side minus z we know dou z by dou y is q so this is equation 3 now let me substitute this 2 in 1 
Now what is x minus h? We got x minus h as minus zp. This is square, so we write square plus y minus k is minus z q square plus z square equals to a square. So square this one, this will be plus z square p square, z square q square, z square. Let we take z square common, we will get p square plus q square plus 1 equals to a square. Now see the next question, form a partial differential equation of, now let us start, this is suppose equation 1. So what we have to do, now we have to differentiate this one, let we partially with respect to x partial differentiation with respect to x. So what we'll get here 2 as it is differentiation partially with respect to z is with respect to x dou z by dou x. See here we don't have x here 0 this is 0. No this is root x power half means root d by dx of root x is 1 by 2 root x. So we'll get like this 1 by 2 root x plus 1 x plus 1 okay. So let me do one thing this is one equation now next one is like again let me differentiate partially with respect to with respect to y so this will become 2 dou z by dou y equals so we don't have y here 0 this is 0 this is root y is 1 by 2 root of y y minus a now see here 2 as it is this is p actually p equals to 1 by 2 root x plus 1 now do we one thing bring this x plus 1 here and 2p here we can write this root of x plus a equals to bring this here it will be 1 by 4p now if you square this one you will get out root here so if you square this will be x plus a equals to 1 by 16p square so suppose this is the equation we are having this is supposed to in the same way let me solve this one this is q so this will be 2q equals to 1 by 2 into under root of y minus a bring this y minus a here and 2q here so under root of y minus a equals to 1 by 2 twos of 4q now square this one if you square this one this will become y minus a equals to 1 by 16q square now see here let me note this one as 3 now watch carefully if we add this 2 you will get plus a minus a will get cancelled and you will get an equation in which we don't have the arbitrary constant so therefore equation 2 plus equation 3 implies what is equation 2 x plus a equation 3 is y minus a equals to 1 by 16 p square plus 1 by 16 q square this plus and minus will get cancelled what will be this one x plus y equals to i'm taking constant 1 by 16 this will become 1 by p square plus 1 by q square also you bring this 16 here you can write like this also 16 into x plus y equals to 1 by p square plus 1 by q square so we have done few questions let me continue this one now you see the next question log of a z minus 1 equals to x plus a y plus b we have to take out a from here let me partially differentiate with respect to x now we know d by dx of log x is 1 by x so this will become 1 by a z minus 1 but we are differentiating partially with respect to x partial differentiation of z with respect to x dou z by dou x equals to now d by dx of x is 1 this is constant this is constant so we get 1 therefore this is p bring this here it will become a z minus 1 so note this one again let me differentiate with respect to y log x is 1 by x 1 by a z minus 1 partial differentiation with respect to y we don't have y here 0 0 y is 1 1 into a is a so this is q bring this here therefore q equals to a into sorry there is a slight mistake log x is 1 by z again we have to differentiate inside no so this is constant z is 1 1 into a is a so we'll get a here so this will become a p in the same way log z is 1 by z internal differentiation 1 is constant 0 z is 1 1 into a is a so we get here a q equals to a into bring this here a z minus 1 so this is the second equation now see here very simple if we divide this 2 and 3 get a a will get cancelled this this will get cancelled okay so let me see what we'll get here what we have to do let me do one thing we will divide this okay 
So, equation 2 by equation 3 implies AP by AQ equals to AP by AQ equals to what will you get here? Let me solve this one. So, this will become AZ minus 1 divided by A into AZ minus 1. So, AZ minus 1, AZ minus 1 will get cancelled. This, this will get cancelled. P by Q equals to 1 by A. Therefore, reverse this one, A equals to Q by P. So, what we got here? We got the value of A equals to. Uh, now, let me substitute this value in. See here, let me substitute the value of A here. See here. So, what will happen? Now, we got the value of A. Now, let me substitute this A here. A is Q by P. P into P equals to A. A is Q by P into Z minus 1. Now let me solve this one. So watch carefully. In place of A, I am writing Q by P into P equals to A. Q by P into Z minus 1. So this Q, P, P will get cancelled. What is left here? Q equals to take LCM. You will get Q Z minus P into 1 is P by P. Now bring this P here, therefore PQ equals to QZ minus P. Or we can solve a little more, bring this P here, we'll get like this PQ plus P equals to QZ. Now take common P here, so that will become Q plus 1 equals to QZ. Now see here, find the differential equation of all spheres whose center lies on Z axis and radius R. Suppose we have to take center on z-axis, suppose this is z-axis. On z-axis, x coordinate is 0, y coordinate is 0. Let me take this value as c. So, z coordinate, let me take this distance as c. So, let me take the center as, what we will get here? We will get the center as 0, 0, c. And what is given here? Radius equals to r. You know the formula, if center is c, a, comma, b, comma, c and radius is r, then the equation of sphere, equation of sphere is, what is its formula? x minus a whole square, x minus 0 whole square, y minus b whole square, z minus c whole square equals to r square. So this will become x square plus y square plus z minus c whole square equals to r square. Now let me start first differentiation partial with respect to x. So x square is 2x. We don't have x here 0. So z square is 2, z means z minus c into. When we differentiate with respect to partially with of z with respect to x is dou z by dou x. This is constant 0. Let, if we take common 2, you will get this cancel. Now this is p. So x plus z minus c into p equals to 0. Therefore, let me do one thing. How can we write z minus c equals to? We can write like this no minus x by p. Bring this x here. z minus c into p is minus x. Bring this p here. Now again, let me differentiate with respect to y. So surely we'll get like this z minus c equals to minus y by q. We'll get like this. No? So watch carefully. This is also x z minus c. This is also z minus c. That means this two will be equal. Therefore, we can write like this, minus x by p equals to minus y by q. Cancel this minus minus. So, this can be the answer. Okay. We can leave here itself or else if you want to solve, you cross multiply this one. If you cross multiply this one, you will get like this, x q equals to p y. Therefore, p y minus x q equals to 0. p y minus x q equals to 0. Now see here, let me have a little change now. Form a partial differential equation by eliminating element arbitrary functions here. Suppose sometimes f of x is given, g of y is given. If the functions are given, we say this is are the arbitrary functions. So when we differentiate f, you can write f dash x. If we differentiate g, you can write g dash y. So in that way, let me differentiate partially with respect to x. So you have to write like this dou z by dou x partially differentiation. First we have to consider this as f of x. So differentiation of f is f dash x square plus y square. 
Now internal differentiation, we are differentiating with respect to x, so x square is 2x. So we can write like this, p equals to 2x into f dash x square plus y square. Similarly, if you differentiate with respect to q, what you will get? q equals to 2y into f dash x square plus y square. So, so it's simple, you see, if you divide this one, you get cancel this arbitrary constant. So we'll get a partial differential equation in terms of x, y, p, q. So divide this one, suppose this is 1, this is 2. So 1 by 2 implies p by q equals to 2x into f dash x square plus y into f dash x square plus. So 2, 2 will get cancelled, this will get cancelled. Therefore, if you cross multiply this p y equals to q x or q x minus p y equals to 0. Now, see your next question z equals to y into f of x plus j x into g of y. Now, let me differentiate with respect to x dou z by dou x that is p equals to with respect to this is constant now f of x differentiation is f dash x plus x is 1 1 into g of y is g of y suppose i am denoting this by 1 now partial differentiation with respect to y dou z by dou y is q y is 1 1 into f of x is f of x plus x as it is constant g y differentiation will become g dash y suppose this is 2 now watch carefully see here now we cannot solve this because we are we are getting many arbitrary constants the f of x g of y f dash x g dash y so we have to again go in so after p q we have to find r so here we cannot solve by just taking these two equations or these three equations it's not possible to solve okay so we have to continue just now we have to find p q let's find r s t what is r here those square z by dou x square that means differentiation of this p no this is dou z by dou x so dou z by dou x is this one so that is again second differentiation will become dou square z by dou x square so we have to differentiate this with respect to x we have to differentiate this with respect to x so y as it is f dash x will become f double dash x f double dash x okay so watch carefully you don't have here x so this is constant 0 p q r now s what is s here dou square z by dou x dou y so we have to differentiate dou x by dou y dou by dou x dou z by dou x with respect to dou by dou y so we have watch carefully this is nothing but we can write like this dou by dou x of dou z by dou y let me write like this dou by dou x of dou z by dou y so dou z by dou y is this one dou z by dou y is this one so we have to differentiate watch carefully watch carefully dou z by dou y to this we have to differentiate with respect to x so this is dou z by dou y we have to differentiate with respect to x so f of x differentiation will be f dash x plus we are differentiating with respect to x so dou by dou z of x is so dou by dou x of x is 1 1 into g dash y this will become g dash y okay so let me note this one as 1 2 3 this suppose as 4 one more thing is left p q r s t what is t here dou square z by dou y square we can write this dou by dou y of dou z by dou y so we have to differentiate dou z by dou y with respect to again y dou z by dou y we have to differentiate with respect to y that is this is dou z by dou y we have to differentiate with respect to y don't have y here this is 0 g dash y if you differentiate you will get g double dash y so note this one phi now observe this one using this all using this all we have to find we have to eliminate the variable we have to eliminate uh, the elementary functions let me find f dash from here and g dash from here if we got f dash and g dash we can substitute here here so in place of s we can substitute now from this you can bring watch carefully from this let me find f dash bring this here p minus what will get here p minus g of y divided by y equals to f dash x see here bring this here 
bring this here p minus g of y by y equals to f dash x in the same from here you find g dash y so bring this here q minus f of x divided by x equals to g dash y now let me substitute this g dash f f f, f dash x and g dash x in s what you are having s s equals to f dash x plus g dash y so let me substitute s equals to f dash x. this is p minus g of y divided by y plus this is q minus f of x by x so if you take lcm what will happen watch carefully let me solve this one implies if you take lcm this will become x y if you take lcm this will become p x minus x g dash g of y plus q y minus y into f of x minus y into f of x bring this x y here s x y equals to watch carefully first i am writing this to p x plus q y if you take minus common here you will get x g y plus y f x so last step so this is given the question as z if you watch carefully z what is question z equals to y f of x plus x g of y so x g of y plus y f of x is nothing but z so write z here so s x y equals to p x plus q y minus this is the question z we can leave here or bring this here p x plus q y minus s x y minus z equals to 0 wherever you want to live you can leave the question now you see the next question form a partial differential equation by limiting the arbitrary function this is the arbitrary function we have to remove now let me differentiate with respect to partial differentiation with respect to z sorry with respect to x so dou z by dou x is nothing but p d by dx of x is 1 1 into y is y f of x differentiation is f dash x now internal differentiation partially with respect to x is 2x i am making this y here so we can write pi y p minus y equals to 2x into f dash x square minus plus y square similarly if you differentiate partially with respect to y you will get like this q minus x equals to 2y into f dash x square plus y square now let me divide this to p minus y by q minus x so this will become 2x into f dash x square plus y square by 2y into f dash x square plus y square so 2 will get cancelled this will get cancelled just cross multiply this one x into q minus x x into q minus x equals to y into p minus y we can live here if you want to solve you can solve by multiplying or you can live here okay so this is the equation or else if you solve a little more if you get like this qx q into x qx minus x square equals to py minus y square I am bringing this here and this here so it will become x square on this side minus y square equals to bring this here qx minus py. Now see on the board we are having two questions z equals to f1 of y plus 2x and f2 of y minus 3x. You try this by yourself this is the example question of the s chance series. Now let me try this one z equals to f of 2x plus y plus g of okay this is little bit bigger question you watch here let me first find all the values because we are having here two unknowns two arbitrary f and g so let us start with p what is b p is nothing but dou z by dou x so differentiate partially with respect to x this f of x will become f dash 2x plus y now internal differentiation y is constant we are differentiating with respect to x d by dx of x is 1 1 into 2 is 2 plus in the same way g will become g dash 3x minus y and if you differentiate internally you get 3 here now let me continue this one p after p we have to take q so what will be q here see here if you solve for q you will get f dash q is dou z by dou y so f will become f dash 2x plus y 
Now internal, we already know this is do z by do x and this is do z by do y. Okay. Now see what we get with respect to y, y is 1, no need to write y here. Now g will become g dash 3x minus y. Now internal differential with respect to y is minus 1, so we get minus here. We get minus here. Now see here, let me continue this one. This is P, this is Q. Now let me find R. What is R? Do square Z by do X square. That is do by do X of do Z by do X. So we have to differentiate do Z by do X. This is, this is P with respect to X. So let me start. F dash will become F double dash. Internal differentiation is 2, 2, 2 is a 4 plus the same way 3 3 is a 9 this will become g double dash 3x minus y 3x minus y so we got this one in the same way p q r s let me find s here you know s is do squared z by do x do y do by do x of you can like like this do by do x of do z by do y do by do x of do z by do y do by do x of do z by that is we have to differentiate partially do z by do y with respect to x that is this is do z by do y we have to differentiate this partially with respect to x so f dash will become f double dash 2x plus y and the internal differentiate is 2 into 1 is 2 in the same way this will become minus internal differentiation is 3 so we get 3 here g dash will become g double dash 3x minus y one more step is left what is p q r now we have to find s and t as last s t sorry so what is t here we know t is do square z by do y square so we can write like this do by do y of do z by do y so we have to differentiate do z by do y that is q that is q with respect this is q we have to differentiate this with respect to y f dash will become f double dash 2x plus y minus g dash will become g dash double dash and this will become minus so minus minus plus so you see here we can write like this t is in terms of f double dash g double dash let me solve this too we will get f double dash g double dash we can for to look easier i am doing one thing let watch carefully i am writing like this f double dash 2x plus y equals to a to look easier solving easier i am writing like this and g double dash 3x minus y equals to b so then what will happen watch carefully we can write like this r equals to 4a plus 9b therefore r equals to 4a plus 9b r equals to 4a plus 9b in the same way s s equals to 2a minus 3b 2a minus 3b now if we solve this one we'll get the values of f double dash and g double dash lastly we can substitute this in t so let me multiply this is equation one this is e2 let me multiply 2 by 2, we will get 4a, 4a will get cancelled. So, therefore, what is here? R equals to 4a plus 9b. If you multiply with 2, this will become 2s equals to 2s equals to 2 2s of 4a minus 2 3s of 6b. Now let me change the sign here. This will become minus minus plus. So, R minus 2s equals to this will get cancelled. This will be 15b. This will be 15b. Now, bring 15 here. Therefore, we get the value of B as R minus 2S by 15. Now, let me substitute in one of this. We will get the value of A. See, I am writing like this. R minus or else I am substituting here. S plus 3B equals to 2A. So, S plus 3 into B is R minus 2S by 15 equals to 2A. 3 ones are 3, 5 are you take LCM. 5 into S, 5S. 5 into s 5s minus 2s will be 3s 3s plus r divided by 5 sorry 5 equals to 2a watch once more what we are doing if we take lcm 5 into s 5s 5s minus 2s is 3s what is kept here left here r by if you bring 2 here it will be 10 therefore a equals to 3s plus r by 10 now we got a and b let me substitute here what is here here t equals to this we supposed as a plus this we supposed as b 
So therefore, t equals to, what is the value of a here? The value of a is 3s plus r by 10 plus b. What is the value of b we got here? The value of b is r minus 2s by 15. Now let me solve this by taking LCM, we'll get the answer here. See, if you take LCM, this LCM will be 30. 30. So 30 means 10 3s are 3 3s are 9s plus 3 into r, 3r. If you take this LCM, 2, 2 into r is 2r minus 2 2s are 4s. Okay. If you take 2, 2r minus 2 2s are 4s. Bring this 30 here. So this will be 30 t equals to 9s minus 4s is 5s plus 9s minus 4s is 5s. 3r r plus 2r is 5r. Now, if you take common phi here, 30 t equals to, if you take common phi, this will become s plus r phi 1s are phi 6. So, this is the answer. Therefore, 6 t equals to s plus r. See here the next type of question. Method for f of u comma v. If the function is like given like this, u comma v equals to 0. f of u comma v equals to 0 where u is a function in terms of x, y, z and v is a function in terms of x, y, z. Then elimination of do f by do u and do f by do v is obtained by using this determinant. Just by heart this determinant, it, it will be easy method for you. What is the determinant? Watch carefully. Do u by do x plus p do u by do x, z. Do u by do y plus q do u by do z. Here what's do v by do x plus p do v by do z dou v by dou y plus q dou v by dou z. We have to find all these values and substitute the determinant. We must solve the determinant. Now see here, I am doing this question. I just write the same in the here. What here? dou u by dou x plus p dou u by dou z. dou v by dou x plus p dou v by dou z. In the same way here, dou u by dou y plus q dou u by dou z dou v by dou y plus q dou v by dou z. So let me substitute these values here. Now see here, let me find one after one. Let me take u equals to x by, sorry, y by. So what do u by with respect to, with respect to x? Now d by dx of 1 by x is minus 1 by x square. You write this y as it is constant. Now this is 1 by x, 1 by x. So d by dx of 1 by x is minus 1 by x square, minus 1 by x square. In the same way, let me find dou u by dou v, dou y, sorry, dou u by dou y. y is in the numerator, d by dy of y is 1, so this will be x, 1 by x. In the same way, let me come here. What is dou u by dou z? We don't have z here, so it is 0. Now same, take here v equals to x square plus y square plus z square dou v by dou x is 2x, x square is 2x, we don't have x here, it will be 0, dou v by dou y, this is 2y, dou v by dou z is 2z. Now let me substitute this in the determinant, dou u by dou x, dou u by dou x is minus y by x square. Now dou p into dou v, dou u by dou z, dou u by dou z is 0. So 0 into p is 0. Come here, dou v by dou x. Dou v by dou x is 2x. And p into plus p into dou v by dou z. Dou v by dou z is 2z. So 2pz let me write like this. And same, come here. What is the next thing? Dou u by dou y. Dou u by dou y is 1 by x. Dou u by dou z is 0. 0 into q will be 0. So come here. What will be here? Dou v by dou y. Dou v by dou y is 2y plus q into dou v by dou z is 2z equals to 0. Now let me solve. You know what is here? This is nothing but cross multiplication determinant. Multiply this to minus this to. So it will become minus y by x square into 2y plus 2qz minus 1 by x into 2x plus 2pz equals to 0. What we did here? Uh, see here. We did one thing. We have to multiply this cross multiplication. Okay, let me do one thing. I am taking minus 1 by x common. 
So if you take x common, what is left here? Minus also we have taken multiply this one. 2y into y, y square plus 2qyz by x. Because one x we have taken common. Minus of this will become 2x. Let me take 2 also common. If we take 2 also common, this 2 will go outside. This 2 will go outside. This is outside. x plus pz equals to 0. If you bring this here, it will be 0. Let me take LCM here. So this will become y square plus qyz minus into plus minus x square minus pxz equals to 0. We can live here or we can take LCM and solve. Okay. If you take minus common, we can write like this also x square minus y square minus qyz plus pxz equals to 0. We did, we just, we did a mistake here. If we take minus common, this will become plus. So this will be plus, this will be plus. Okay. So we have done few questions on this methods, how to make form partial differential equation by eliminating arbitrary constants and arbitrary functions. You practice few more questions on these types, inshallah. The same types questions, few more questions you practice from the textbook. You'll get the perfections in this, okay. So, inshallah, in the next question, we will see how to solve the partial differential equations of different types. Okay. So, let me solve the partial differential equation in the next class. I request all you to like, to share, and subscribe my channel.